Hey boys, today I thought I would try something interactive with you. It will work on approximately 90% of the population, so hopefully you'll have some success with it. You will need to open up the calculator function on your computer or phone, or just go and grab a calculator, you know, one of the physical old type ones you might have in a drawer somewhere. While you're doing that, press pause and then come back to me once you've got your calculator ready. In a second, I want you to think of a three-digit number where all the digits are different. 396 would be a good result. And when you're thinking of your three-digit number, place it into the calculator. For example, I might think of 495, and then I'd place 495 into the calculator. Then when I'd done that, I'd press minus. And then placing the reverse of your number, in my example of 495, if I reverse that, it becomes 594. So I would place 594 into the calculator and then press equals. You will end up now with a two or three digit number. If it's a negative, as in my example of negative 99, ignore the negative sign and just focus on the number. So in my example, I just focus on the number 99. Whatever you are left with, this is your end number randomly created by you. Here's the really interesting thing. Approximately 57% of you will have the end number of 199. Eight. You're quite visual when you take in information and your subconscious mind has been aware of the end number from the very beginning and that's why you got there. It's been on plain sight the entire time. 198, just there. Now 33% of you will have the end number 396. You take in more information through sound and words and your subconscious mind picked up on the very first number that I mentioned and you're going to record it now. Here, I'll play it for you. 396 would be a good result. Now you remember that now, and that went deep into your head and enabled you to get to the target 396. Don't be sad if this didn't work for you. It's simply your brain went for both the visual and the auditory information at the same time and didn't know which one to go for and ended up on a completely random result. If it didn't work for you, show a friend and see if it works for them. And if it worked or didn't work for you, let us all know by placing a comment down there. And remember, voyeurs, from the mind, keep it real. Well, all right. Well, Paul Brook knows just what you're thinking, and he knows just what you're feeling. He can pick up on the slightest cues. He knows what's lies and what's the truth. Paul Brook understands when you're feeling low. Paul Brook understands when you're feeling high. Just let him get inside your mind.